Hello everyone, this is Landon here, and I have a request from the Jimmy JLC on making a bridge conveyor belt tutorial. Now, they are kind of weird. Um, you'll see a few things. There's a few quirks about them. Um, I didn't do anything ahead of time, so this is just my current knowledge of them. We might find out some things during the video. But uh, they work like this, and let's see, the exact comment was, can you do a video on the bridge conveyor? Whenever I try to use it, it doesn't seem to work correctly. So, you set it up, obviously this is the direction of where the items are going, and I will show two demonstrations that I know off the top of how these things work. Um, so we have them going down. We have an entry point here. Now we're gonna find out how the entry point works, but this is currently how it works just from, <laughs> it's an item source with no item, interesting. Okay, item void down here. All right, so this is a conveyor belt going like that, right? Okay, so now we're gonna do a router entry, all right, and that obviously is working. Okay, now we're gonna do going like this. Does that work? That also works. So you can try them from angles. Okay. So with that, um, issues might be. Hmm. So it doesn't seem to work correctly. I'm kind of curious as to in what way. Hmm, it doesn't seem to work correctly. Maybe, maybe it's this. No. So you can enter this way. So I'm curious as to what the issue might be. And because if it works like that, hmm, interesting as well. It, so this is an exit from any side. That is that is really cool. However, I think that's only if there's items coming in from the segment beforehand. Is it not going to do it? That is weird. Why does it do that? Oh, it's only because that's, okay. So if you go like this, then it exits to the side. So that's also interesting. So maybe there's something blocking it. Like if you have, no, that, that might not be the case. I don't know, that's weird. Maybe it is bridge conveyor like, like that. Whoa. Interesting. So that's cool. Can you do more than one? I don't think you can do more than one, but we'll try it. No, you can only do one way. However, um, <laughs> check this out. Hmm, that's cool. That is really neat. Look at that. It might be because it's exiting here, but yeah, that's that's why it's exiting here. So let's try bridge conveyor this way. There's items in it. Interesting, very interesting. So that's neat. Um, maybe the issue is now solved. But that's really neat. It's like a splitter. It's literally like. A router but you can jump over so inverted sorter oh my gosh what does this even mean it means that the item you identify goes left to right but only what you don't identify goes forward that's good I'm gonna have to make a new video because 
over advanced conveyor logic because that's just all right anyway anyway that's a tangent all right so that's how bridge conveyors work i don't know if there's any other specific thing i haven't experimented over this but if you want me to post an experimentation video over conveyors i'll do that it'll be like you know an off-the-cuff experimentation sort of thing but anyway um let me know if this cleared it up if not i'll make another video and we'll go from there so thank you guys for watching um, post any comments or questions and i will address them all right uh, i'll see you guys later and have a good day